Good morning. Hello. How are we? Um, for some of you about watching this, it might be morning. From some of you watching it, it might be in the evening. But for me, it's morning. So, um, as you see, I kind of have a mess on my desk right now. And that's because I am trying to figure out what to do with this binder. So, and forgive me, my dogs are in the room. So I have this binder. This binder came from Soul Mama um, on Amazon, from Amazon. And it came with envelopes. <clears throat> These are not the envelopes, but it came with envelopes. It came with stickers. It came with everything that you need for you know a starting binder but i have actually i have an extra binder so i'm trying to figure out what to do with it and i was watching a video last night and the person was setting up a a self-care binder and that is something that i definitely do not have hold on all right i'm back so <coughs> excuse me so the person who set has self-care binder where they, um, you know, had envelopes for all of their self-care items. I do not do a lot of self-care things outside of the home. Most of my self-care is done inside my home, but I figure I can create <clears throat> A self care binder for certain things that I do know that I need to get done. Um, so I'm just gonna going to go through that process with you. So a couple of things that I do. I get, I would say my eyebrows, and I'm writing this out because I'm not gonna print the. Uh, I'm not gonna um make the labels I have a Cricut so I can make labels I'm not going to make the labels on camera um, I might do them or I might just use some of these labels I have to see what I have because I do have quite a few um, and I do kind of want it to be fluid um, where everything matches so I would say eyebrows that's one thing haircuts because I do have short hair so I do need to do better when it comes to getting my hair cut because it's time and I haven't been to the barber yet um I don't wax but it's something that I'm considering trying so I might make an envelope for that massage definitely I definitely need to do that and I only pulled out like five envelopes. So <clears throat> three, four, and five. Here's my five. So I only need five categories to start with. Now, I do see that I have a beauty. I have personal. Um, I have care. beauty miscellaneous okay and then I have health rent birthday okay so I'll figure it out I'm not sure which ones I'm gonna use so um I'm drawing a blank on my categories but <clears throat> oh Manny and Petty Manny Petty so that's definitely <clears throat> I'll say my five top five categories right now now, I'll probably add to this. I will probably take away. So I'm going to say, I'm going to write down a value for each item. So that way, hold on. I'm standing, so let me sit. I'm going to write down an item for each one. So that, I mean a price or an amount for each one. So that way, I know what I should have in that envelope. So eyebrows are about <clears throat> 10 to $15, depending on where you go. I just get a wax, wax my eyebrows, and I go <laughs> maybe twice a year, but the goal is to increase that. 
Um, so I will say I'm gonna budget $20 for eyebrows. Hair, I'm gonna say I need at least $50 to get a haircut. And that's including tip, wax, I don't even know. And I'm not even sure if that's a category that I'm going to use, but I'll say $100 for a wax and that's bikini area maybe underarms. Massage, um, I'm gonna say 200 for a massage. And Manny Petty, I'm gonna say 100. So that is 450, 470. So in this envelope, in this binder, I'm gonna put these four, five categories. And, oh, forgot about these so self-care clothing these are some parts these are not completed I have to do these over or finish these but these envelopes are completed so um I made these using my Cricut and using Velo um <sighs> laminate paper <laughs> I just lost my train of thought so I will add clothing because this is something for me. This is gonna be a me binder. So I'll say maybe a hundred dollars for clothing. Of course, that's, I don't shop that often for clothes, which I probably should, but I don't. So I'll just say a hundred dollars. And then self-care, I will count this self-care even though everything on here is a self-care item, but I would use this envelope for toiletries. So I forgot to add that to my list and forgive my handwriting. So um, I probably won't use this. I'll just create one that says toiletries. So toiletries, I will say, I'm gonna just say $75 cause I don't, I buy, I usually buy in bulk and then don't rebuy until I run out. Um, oh, I will say entertainment so that if I want to take myself out on a date or if maybe I want to go out with friends or maybe just take my daughter to the movie, I think this should be $200, but I'm going to budget and just say $250. I'm sorry, $150. Um, and I will add some additional envelopes. So we have five, six. Actually, I'm not going to count that one. Six. So I just need one more envelope, quite honestly, because I'm going to use this. Um, actually, in clothing, I'm going to just put this if I can see if this fits. Does that work? I'm going to just put them inside like this. And maybe that's what I'll do with um, instead of creating the label, maybe I'll just redo or just add some of these as an insert just to match if I can find this vinyl if i have more of it maybe i'll do that we'll see okay so that is my envelope that i'm gonna work on for uh today i'll work on this envelope today and i wanted to show you oh here's another savings tracker so the cool thing about this is we added some more so we gotta add this up so I have 470, that's 570. Uh, let me get a calculator. Alrighty. So I'm here. I got 570 plus 75 plus 150. So 795, if that's correct. So four, five. That's six. That's 745 plus 50. Yeah, okay, so that's right. So 795 is the goal for this envelope. Of course, that'll be um, 
it may or may not be fully funded um but i will just use the money as needed i will use sinking challenges i will just kind of do some cash stuffing i'll use different ways of filling these envelopes um and then use as needed like even though i need the massage i probably won't do the massage until who knows when um the hair eyebrows and maybe the mani pedi are the three categories that i'll probably use the most so those will need to be funded, but <clears throat> excuse me, the others are, well, and entertainment because I do like to go to the movies, occasionally eat out, well, eat out. So those are my categories. So we're going to put this side for a moment. And I'll just put this in here just in case I decide to use it. And <clears throat> I want to show you guys some other sinking fun, um, challenges that I found. Um, I am in a group on Facebook that one of the members created these and I think she did an amazing job. So I will laminate these and put them inside my binder just to use as challenges. I like these challenges because these are smaller challenges. So I feel like these are more budget friendly challenges for people who are newly in to um newly into budgeting or challenges and they're low increments so they're like ten dollars five dollars fifteen dollars it's almost like the snowball method where you feel a sense of accomplishment because you've completed this so i'm going to start these and i will do one every month and then of course we have some larger challenges that may take time these have $50 in them, $4,000. These have different increments for $2,000 and $3,000. And this is to build up. So, you know, they always say you should at least have $1,000 saved. So that's the initial goal. And then we have this one also was designed, which is amazing. Um, and it's also monthly and it's $5 a month. $500 a month, sorry. And if you want to know where I got these from, just message me um, in the comments and I will share that information with you. Let me see what else we have. Um, all right. Well, that looks like it's pretty much all that I had planned for today. Oh, I did want to show you guys something else. Hold on. Okay, so like I said, I'm all about the challenges. So <clears throat> I did get these books, binders from Timu. I think I got them from Timu. So this is $150 saving challenge. This is a $300 savings challenge, and this is a $500. I'm going to take them one at a time. So right now, I'm working on the $150. I did have to remove some cash, and that's normal. That's going to happen when you're early on in your budgeting. You know, you think you got it figured out. You're like, okay, I'm going to stick to this plan. But something comes up, and you have to pull the money. So that's what I did. So I have 5 10 20 and another 20 is 40. So, so far I have 40 of my $150. And <clears throat> I had to remove, I think $10 or something like that. Part of the problem is I don't cash. I don't get cash often when I get paid because usually um, bills need to be paid at that moment. I don't have my one month ahead fund fully funded yet, but I'm hoping that'll be soon. I'll have that done soon. So that money will be in the bank as a nice little cushion so that I can, um, you know, be able to spend some more time. Well, allow myself to put more money into my savings challenges because that is my main goal right now. Um, well, two goals. My goal is to save money and pay down debt, pay off debt. I want to be debt free. Um, that is a goal for me within the next, 
I'm going to say four years to be debt free. That's a, that's because I know myself, this is going to be, it's going to be a challenge, but I'm up for the challenge and I'm going to just remind myself of why I'm doing this. So, um, these, uh, like I said, I got from Timu. It says budget with Carly. So that's where these say they came from. Um, I have not started. I'm going to, uh, like I said, I will fill one at a time. So once I fill the 150, then I'll go to the 300. Or what I did do the first time is if I fill in all of my spaces. So this one starts at five, then it's 10, 15, and 20. So <clears throat> if all of my 10 spots are filled and I don't have a five to make it a 15, then I will put the $10 in here and start this. So there may be some simultaneous starts. Um, I had done that, but like I said, I had to pull the money out. So, but that is what we are working on. Like I said, guys, please like and subscribe. My channel is very, very new. Um, I appreciate the viewers that have been viewing so far. Um, very much appreciated. Uh, I hope to continue to grow this channel. Um, I will also be working on making envelopes um, to be available. So if you are interested in something like this envelope, or the credit card ones, it can be customized to whatever you want to go here. Um, and whatever you want to go here, I can make those envelopes for you um, for sale. Um, but yes, please like and subscribe. And I will see you guys on the next video. Bye-bye.